Next, a new hydropower facility has been opened right in the heart of Bedford. The system, which uses water from the River Great Ooze to drive massive screws, is based on a theory devised more than 2,000 years ago, as James Bush reports. Looking to the future by looking to the past. Bedford's new hydropower facility uses the same principles pioneered by Archimedes back in the days of ancient Greece. Giant screw turbines are driven by the power of the water to produce electricity for the town. The older technologies, they come 200 years BC, Archimedes screw, we've actually linked that up so it's internet connected, so we can actually check it in the office. It will automatically shut down if the water levels get wrong, working with the environment agencies to make sure we don't actually sort of, uh, take stuff up the top level to put in the bottom level it's inappropriate. More than 200 people turned up for the opening ceremony. The plant is situated at the boatside weir on Bedford's embankment and should generate around 168,000 kilowatt hours of energy a year. That's enough to power all the lights along Bedford's embankment with some left over for the national grid. In cash terms, that would save the council around £32,000 a year. The company which built it says more and more local authorities are looking at schemes like this. It's nice to be involved in a, in a project like this, it's raising a lot of awareness for the local people. Um, there's a lot of other interest in and around this area has been generated as well by, by people seeing this in the press. Based on principles developed thousands of years ago, this station should now produce clean, renewable energy for generations to come. James Bush, Anglia News.